In this Greatest Jokes Ever, we delve into an old question, wives versus girlfriends? But when the joke is done, just wait for the moral of the story. Might just save your life. Ever wondered the difference between a wife and a girlfriend? Don't ask me. My Google search history is just, do you also get lonely? But hey, maybe my grandpa knows. He's been married for 40 years which basically qualifies him as an expert on technology outages disguised as human relationships. So, before we dive into the ancient texts of marriage manuals, let's rewind to the simpler times, back when the most advanced gadget was a toaster and technology came unplanned just like some people, the development of the telephone. While Italian innovator Antonio Mucci is credited with inventing the first basic phone in 1849, and Frenchman Charles Boursoul devised a phone in 1854, Alexander Graham Bell won the first US patent for the device in 1876. The smartphone industry has been steadily developing and growing since 2008, both in market size and in number of models and vendors. Smartphone shipments worldwide added up to around 1.2 billion units in 2022, declining from 2021. By the end of 2022, 68% of the world's population were smartphone users. Electronic television was first successfully demonstrated in San Francisco on Scepter 7, 1927. The system was designed by Philo Taylor Farnsworth who had been working on it since 1920. Telstar, the first commercial communication satellite, was launched in 1962. Now, when it comes to main telephone events, the first transcontinental telephone line is established in 1913. The first cross-country radio telephone service is established in 1933. So yeah, from rotary phones to self-driving cars, Humanities come a long way. Now, buckle up for a journey even more mind-blowing. How the hell do TVs and telephones connect your girlfriend and your wife? Trust me, it's not about playing Candy Crush. Get ready for a punchline so unexpected. It'll make dial-up sound futuristic. So, this boy and his grandfather were sitting on the porch having a chat when the boy got a very serious smirk on his face. Grandpa looked like he'd swallowed a lemon. So I popped him the age-old question. Wives versus girlfriends. What's the deal? He scratched his beard. Gears grinding. Squinted at him, like he was tuning in an old rabbit ears channel. Well, it will take some explaining, my boy. But let's do it by making some modern-day comparisons. Son, he rasped. Wives are like a 52-inch TV. Girlfriends are like sleek smartphone you sneak a glance at under the table. TV is big bulky and most of the time old, while the mobile is cute slim, shaped like a sand dune. New, but more replaceable. At home you watch TV, but when you go out, you take your mobile. Cannot do without it. So, TV at home. Girlfriend away from home. You only still enjoy your television when something good is happening. Like when a pig fly and land safely. But you enjoy your smartphone so much, you are willing to play with it most of the time. TVs tend to be with you for many years. But mobile phones, you change every other year. You friends are not interested if you get a new television. But they do take notice of you have a new smartphone. TV is normally good and free for life, but the moment you don't pay for your mobile, the services will be terminated. When you go to do shopping for real men, like the fishing tackle shop, don't see anyone taking their TV along, but the mobile always tag along. Now don't even get me started on cost. No comparison. The phone is like a bottomless pit for your wallet. Data plans, cracked screens, new charger every other week. It's crazy. T 
TV is one-way communication. Watch and listen. With your mobile phone, you can talk, have an opinion, and be listened to. So, which is best, Grandpa? The boy asked. Now that's a totally different equation, the Grandpa responded. TV, cheaper on cost. TV, switch it off when you want to. You switch your mobile off, and everyone wants to know what's wrong. When you get much older like me, the Grandpa said, I can still see the TV and still understand the remote, but have no interest anymore in the new smart devices. When the kids come to visit, we can all still have a bit of family time enjoying the TV, but the mobile phones are not so much for family entertainment anymore. When your time come to spend your last days in hospital, you will probably still have a TV to watch from your bed. You will be searching for programs on what's on the other side but there will be no more interest or usage for your mobile phone. So, spend more time with your TV, as it is still the glue to the family, and less time with your phone, and you will have a happy ending. <laughs> Moral of the story is this. If wife versus girlfriend was a marathon, then the wife would be those comfortable shoes that make the running easier. The girlfriend will be the water you get at the water point. Looks great as you are getting close. Can't wait to take a sip. But that water bottle might just be filled with vinegar. <laughs> if you like our jokes, Please watch our next joke by clicking here. <laughs>